Stripe payment tutorial how to set up Stripe as a complete beginner. Hi guys, welcome back. Today I'm going to be giving you a tutorial on Stripe how we can receive payments and send payouts using Stripe. So let's get started. First, what you have to do is you will simply go to stripe.com and you will land on this platform right here. Stripe is a payment infrastructure that allows you to accept payments and send payouts on your websites and marketplaces. With Stripe, you will be able to send invoices and create visual cards, get financing, manage business spends, and more. We can add Stripe to our online stores and websites that we create, and we can integrate to any kind of platform. With Stripe, we can add our debit cards and add our payment method. It is really secure and has all the right integrations for us. To get started with Stripe, you will find the sign in option right here. Click on sign in and then we will click on sign up because we are signing up for the first time. You can sign up for Stripe with your email address, enter your full name, select your country and set up a reasonable password. So I will quickly go ahead and fill in this form. Once you have entered the detail, you will click on create account and your new account will be created on Stripe. Once you sign up, this is where you will land. This is our main dashboard. So on Stripe, you will find the home option, payment, balances, customers, products, reports, connect and more. In more, we have payment link, invoices, subscriptions, terminal, connect, identify, tax, radar, and more. So we can activate our payments with this option right here. I will also be able to send invoices and add payment links. We also get our overview right here, our gross volume, net volume sales, second per customer, issues volume, and others. So I will click on activate payment. Now, to activate payment, what you need to do is simply enter your business type. In here, first, we will have to enter our business detail because Stripe allows us to create payment methods and add payment methods to our business stores that we have, to our online stores that we create on Shopify, on Wix, WooCommerce, Amazon, and more. So, to connect search platform to a to an online store where you will be accepting payments you need to add your business details so first we have business type and in here you can select individual click on continue then we have business details business details simply means that you will ha have to enter more of your business details such as your legal name on the documents home address phone number and your social security number then we have personal details, fulfillment details, and public details. Then we also will have to enter our bank details because the payments received on Stripe will be added to our bank account. Then we have tax calculation, climate contribution, and summary. So you can just fill up these forms to activate the payment methods. Once you do, then your account will officially be activated and you will be able to accept payments on Stripe or send payouts using Stripe. Then we have the payment option right here. To create payment, you can click on create payment option. We can add a payment right here. Let's say that I have an, a payment of $100. Then I will have to enter my details for my customer. You can add more customers as well. To enter a brand new customer, you enter the name, then email address and description we can also enter billing information but for now i will click on add customer and a brand new customer will be added now i want to you know create a payment for this customer so my payment is hundred dollars which is in usd we get all of these different currencies here and you can select from any of the currency we have description statement descriptor and payment method manually enter card information so in here from where you will be doing the payment right you will enter your card details and these hundred dollars will be added right here to stripe and you will be able to add a payment you will be able to send a payment to to a client wherever they are without any text using stripe so enter your card right here and the you can also save the date for the customer 
um, you can also save the card to a customer once you have added all the details you can submit the payment and this payment will be submitted on stripe and it will be sent accordingly we can also create invoices on stripe so to create an invoice you can go to invoice option right here click on create a new invoice now again we have to enter the customer let's go ahead and create a new customer we have to enter the email address select the language and click on save customer so now we have created a brand new customer we will click on item and you can enter any kind of item or create a new item right now let's say that i'm creating an invoice for a product so i will click on create new product or item and type in the item name let's say that i'm creating this invoice for a service that i provided so i'm just going to type in the word service the quantity is one and the price is hundred dollars i can add more but for now i will click on save so we have one item if i want to add more items i can then we have a memo you can just write whatever i have written thanks for your business this is the due date you can change the due date accordingly then we have payment option and we have wechat pay card credit card and we can also add more options such as ACH debit transfer then we have advanced option and in here we have custom invoice fields but for now I think this looks pretty good this is the preview of my invoice that has been created so this is uh, the two and this is the total invoice and I will click on review or hide the invoice I will click on review enter the email address if I want to and continue editing once my invoice is created i can just go ahead and, and download it as a pdf as well or i can also download the payment page this is how we simply create invoices on stripe then we have the balance option and in balances we have our total balance in usd you can also select different currencies from here and you can add a bank account to add a bank account to your stripe you can click on this button right here add your account holder name routing number account number confirm account number and click on add bank and it will be added right here then we have customers and as i showed you to create a customer you can click on add customer and it's really easy you enter name account email and description then we have product as i showed you to create a product click on add product enter the product name description and price we can also upload an image click on save product and a new product is created Similarly, we have reports and in reports, I will be able to get my financial reports, billing, payment authentication, Sigma custom reports, card monitoring programs. Again, we have connect and in connect, I will be able to connect my marketplaces, e-commerce platform and software platforms to my Stripe right here. In here, we actually connect our different platforms such as our Wix, WooCommerce, Squarespace, Shopify, or any software that you are using. In more, again, we have more options such as invoices that I showed you, subscription. We can connect our PayPal. We can also verify our identity, check the taxes, financial, and more. So Stripe is all in one platform, which is very easy to use and has all the right features and tools to help you run a successful business online it will help you send invoices create customers connect your marketplaces e-commerce platforms and also activate your payment and business online so yeah guys this brings us to the end of the video i hope that i was a big help to you and now you know how to use stripe as a complete beginner don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to the youtube channel